Jim Carrey claims Donald Trump is a reptilian Illuminati blood prince. Jim Carrey has told fans and supporters that Donald Trump is not human, but is a reptilian that shapeshifts between human and reptile form. And he has witnessed the president shapeshift, quote, in the flesh before my very eyes, and in my opinion as a personal warning to me, unquote. Speaking to supporters at the Signature Gallery in Las Vegas where he is hosting his first ever art exhibit, Sun Shower, the beloved comic actor dropped hints about the themes buried deep in his paintings. Quote, I am interested in what is beyond the veil of reality, the real power structures that control the universe. I'm no longer interested in the daily facade. I've put everything I know into these paintings, unquote. Kerry first met Donald Trump at a boxing match held at the Trump Hotel and Casino in Atlantic City in the early 90s, a popular TV actor at the time. Kerry was criticized by Trump's associates for failing to entertain the future president. But according to Kerry, he was, quote, avoiding him like the plague, unquote, because he witnessed Trump shapeshift when he arrived at the venue. Quote, Donald Trump has a long reptile face and oversized beak, and his scales are a disgusting gray color, like sewer water, unquote, Kerry said, explaining that Donald Trump shapeshifted between this state and his human form at least three times while greeting him. Kerry claims that he also saw Trump shapeshifting while meeting other celebrity guests. Quote, his hands turned into scaly reptile hands while he gesticulated at random acquired objects he deemed beautiful or valuable. When he smiled, his teeth changed into razor-sharp reptile teeth and glisten like jewel-encrusted daggers. It wasn't just me. I'm not going to name names, but these secrets are well known in certain circles, among those in the know, unquote. Kerry says he believes Trump shapeshifted while greeting him as a show of strength and a warning not to mess with the dominant reptilian political Illuminati, of which he is a blood prince. Quote, this branch of the Illuminati, the most powerful branch, they come from Bavaria, Kerry said explaining that Bavaria is Trump's ancestral homeland, unquote. Asked if he had proof of his claims, Kerry told his supporters to watch what happens when these issues get raised in the media. The gatekeepers will try to deny I said these things. When that doesn't work, they will try and destroy my reputation. Kerry also told his fans and supporters to look deeply at his artworks, to decipher their real meaning. Quote, there are some things you can't say, but you can paint. I have put everything I know into these paintings, unquote. Quote, it's 1 a.m. I'm eating goldfish and talking about reptilianism with new friends. I've never felt more at peace, Kerry said. And this is from the writer of the article. He goes on and says, Kerry's first-hand experiences with the reptilian Illuminati chime with my own research and second-hand accounts. I have dedicated the last five years to researching the elusive, tyrannical powers that rule our world. Traveling to over 80 countries, and it never ceases to amaze me how many people from very different walks of life have told me stories about seeing people briefly turn into reptilians before their very eyes. I've been told this by Californian news anchors, Ethiopian goat herders, and Australian aboriginals, just to name a few. A Danish taxi driver described driving past a group of VIP guests at the 2014 Bilderberg meeting in Copenhagen and seeing some of their faces turn reptilian and some of their hands and feet take on a reptilian look. In Peru, a respected psychic told me she sees people in power like Obama, David Cameron, and Hillary Clinton turning the reptiles whenever she watches, watches an international news channel. The world's ruling class have tyrannical control over the mainstream media, as well as our food, water, and air supply, and they are actively dumbing down the masses. The evidence against them, ancient and modern, is enormous and continuing to grow. And that was by Baxter Dimitri. Check him out. What happened? Give me a, give me a, give me a, for instance. I, I, I want to know. I'm turning, I'm turning red. I'm so embarrassed. No, don't be embarrassed. Come on, share. Why not? We have to discuss let's these just, things. Let's, let's just say I was with somebody once, and, and I saw, I saw a transformation that I can't explain. Mm. The person transformed into something other than human. Yes, I saw it. Were you on drugs? I was not. I was totally sober. Wow. 
you were talking with, I'm just going to, I'm asking you some questions. <laughs> if you were, ta- you were talking to someone yes. and you're having a conversation, yes. like we are now, yeah. this close. <laughs> and the person suddenly, not in a hallucination, they said to you, look, something's going to happen here. Mm-hmm. I'm going to show, I'm going to morph into something else. Mm-hmm. And you're like, well, this is ridiculous. That's not how it happened. T- give me, give me, give me, give me a please. I no, want to see this. Imagine you're doing something and suddenly you turn around and there's somebody else standing there. A different human. Sort of. It's hard to explain without going to detail. I'd rather you, not go into details. Okay. But did you say to the person, what'd you just do here? That's yes. You. And they acknowledged it. And oh. and what did they say they were? From another planet? And they wouldn't explain. It's up there with one of the most intense things I've ever been through. Could Donald Trump really be a reptilian? Like Jim Carrey says... Let's check out some other theories, and you let me know what you think. Could Donald Trump be an extraterrestrial? Is Donald Trump an alien? As some have said, Professor Rick Sanchez went so far as to write a book called Is Donald Trump an Alien? Let's read the summary. Is Donald Trump an alien? This must be the most important question of our time, our entire independence. And freedom as a species depends on it. If Donald Trump is an alien, what does that mean for America and the world? Will it mean the end of life as we know it? Or will it be the dawn of an intergalactic trade relation that benefits the universe? Okay, so I'm going to show you a couple assets and you be the judge. There was a new report written by Salon.com from one of the top psychiatrists in the country. And the title of the article was called, Psychiatrist Says Donald Trump Displaying Anti-Human Tendencies. So let's read a bit of that real quick and I'll show you a clip. Yale psychiatrist Dr. Bandy Lee spoke to Salon.com recently where she offered even more disturbing analysis about Donald Trump's mental health. According to Dr. Lee, Trump is exhibiting anti-human tendencies during his daily coronavirus briefings and that he isn't capable of caring about other human beings. The president, to put it bluntly, is a sociopath, as Ring of Fire's Farron Cousins explains. This is what Dr. Lee had to say. We have handed power to someone who is anti-human in psychology. Anti-human. The group he has isolated may not be ethnic, but it is his own cultural grouping of non-voters or critics when he has withheld life-saving equipment from states where governors have criticized him, such as New York, California, Washington, or Michigan, while giving a surplus to states with sycophantic governors, such as Florida. When criminality combines with mental pathology, this kind of large-scale violence becomes possible. Eventually, it will be destructive to all. Donald Trump exhibits anti-human psychology, according to Dr. Lee. And I agree with her 100%. So I think we need to take Dr. Lee for her word here, because this is real. This is something that we all have to take very seriously. Not just in the electoral sense, but in the sense of people are dying in this country because the president is a sociopath. He is incapable of empathy. He is incapable of thinking of others and his narcissistic personality traits are being exploited as Dr. Lee points out here by the sycophants. Could Donald Trump be of extraterrestrial origin? Could he be a time traveler from the future as some have claimed? Let me know what you think in the comments. Raymond Noodle Gang. We the Raymond Noodle Gang. Gang. Raymond